Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am Murray from Willis Nation and today I am going to be revisiting a tutorial I did almost a year ago and that, that tutorial is how to install GTA San Andreas multiplayer on the Steam version of GTA San Andreas. Now the, the first thing you want to do is you want to go to your C drive and go to program files and you want to find the Steam folder right here and then you want to go to Steam apps and then common and then you want to find the Grand Theft Auto San Andreas folder and what you want to do is you want to copy this to wherever you want to install the game at I'm going to copy it to the downloads but I already have it there so I'm going to just leave it alright so then you have this folder it's the exact same thing and you can delete both of these exe files and then what you want to do is you want to go to the media fire link in the description and download this I already have that as well as you can see down at the bottom so what you want to do is you want to just move it in there and then you see it's the same thing except it has an underscore instead of a dash and what you want to do is you want to go to the sa-mp.com download uh, the mirror by the same team and you get you get this for whatever version you get you want to double click click yes and that pops up click I agree now you want to see you can't click install so you gotta browse you gotta go to wherever you saved it I saved it in the downloads so I want to go here and you see if I ha don't have this folder with the downloaded GTA SA EX file uh, th then I can't click OK so this is the folder with the EXE file so that means I can click OK so that works and you click install and it'll do its thing click finish and then you can go in here and you can play SAMP as you do so the reason I redid this tutorial is because the other one was a little hard to follow and a bad quality, so I wanted to remake it. Uh, so yeah, if this video helped you, click, click the like button. It makes me feel good. <laughs> and if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below, and I will do my best to answer them. So thank you, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.